Welcome back to the Real Estate News. Now, a lot of times we talk about getting a home inspection as you're buying a home, but it's also important to get a pre-sale inspection too. And here today to talk about that is Matthew Schwenninger of Badger Home Inspections. Thanks, Matthew, for coming on the show today to educate us on this. Let's talk pre-sale inspections. How important are they? Hey, thanks for having me. Uh, pre-sale inspections play a really important role in trying to get the homeowner to get the most value out of their house when they go to sell it. Now, the biggest thing is people get into their houses and don't realize quite how old things are really getting. So you say, so you say that, so what are some of the things that people overlook? Because I suppose when you live in your house every day, there's some things where you feel like, you know, you just you don't even see it anymore or you feel like you just bought your you know your your stove or whatever it is what are some of the things that you're seeing sure so a lot of things come down to just the age of your mechanicals people tell me all the time oh we just replaced our our water heater it seemed like yesterday turns out it's 10 years old already so roofs uh mechanicals such as your furnace your water heater your ac things like that they all get old and we don't even realize it yeah, it's true. It's it's funny how those purchases sort of stick out in your mind and it literally feels like you just did it last year and yeah, a decade exactly goes by. Right. So why would you recommend that people get this inspection before they list their home and, and be the one to initiate it as the seller? Well, as we know, spring season is right around the corner. People are about to list their house. Wouldn't you rather make sure that that's as smooth of a process as possible? To where you don't all of a sudden get hit with big bills to replace uh, different things throughout your house. Wouldn't you rather have it up front where you can budget for it, replace it, get it taken care of, get your full asking price? Yeah, that's true. I mean, there's nothing worse than having to rush and do that all in a short time frame when you're just trying to get your house sold. So that's a good point. Now, if people are having open houses, can you use your reports during that? You certainly can. It's actually a great selling tool. Uh, it'll go through all of the different aspects of the house, give you a full list, detailed descriptions, the whole nine yards. And as the buyer of the report, you can use it for anything you choose to do. That's got to be, I would imagine, a pretty good selling point for the home, too. I mean, I would just feel good as a buyer coming into an open house and seeing that, and I would just sort of, my confidence level would go up that things have been taken care of. So. How much do you think that this speeds up the process then? Is it just to sort of depend on how much is, is gone wrong or what would you say to that? Well, ultimately, the fewer things that show up in an inspection, the quicker the process is going to be. So to that point, you really have a lot of built-in value to it. Yeah, you definitely do. And, and sometimes you just need to get out of your home, you know, when you need to get out of it too. And to have that selling process go quickly is really pretty valuable. Well, thanks so much, Matt, for coming on the show today and stay with us. There's a lot more great stuff right after this. Thank you.